Don't Break a Mirror, Unveiling the Superstition. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language and culture. Today, we're exploring an intriguing phrase, don't break a mirror. It's not just about the physical act of breaking glass, but there's a deep-seated superstition and cultural meaning behind it. Let's unravel the mystery together and see what makes this phrase so significant in English-speaking cultures. The belief that breaking a mirror brings bad luck has roots in ancient history. Ancient Romans were among the first to propagate this superstition, believing that a mirror contained a part of the soul. Thus, breaking a mirror would damage the soul of the person who broke it. They also thought that our lives run in seven-year cycles, which is why the bad luck was believed to last for seven years. Mirrors are not just tools for reflection. They hold significant symbolic weight in many cultures. They're seen as portals to another world, or as objects holding mystical powers. In literature and folklore, mirrors symbolize truth, self-awareness, and sometimes, vanity. This symbolic importance adds layers of meaning to the superstition of breaking a mirror. In today's world, the saying, don't break a mirror, is often used more humorously or lightly, but some still take it seriously. Beyond superstition, there's a practical side to this advice. Mirrors are sharp, and breaking them can lead to physical harm. It's also a reminder of being cautious and respectful towards the objects and beliefs that hold cultural significance. We hope this exploration of the phrase, don't break a mirror, has been enlightening. It's fascinating how a simple act can be imbued with such deep cultural and symbolic meaning, bridging past and present. Whether you're superstitious or not, Understanding these cultural nuances is a great way to deepen your knowledge of the English language and its cultural heritage. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.